Etrachan saw it. I'm Kuroki. I'm a truck driver. I deliver office supplies and other goods to people around town. Where to next? All right, let's go. Digital Support Co. OX Building. This was a big client of ours. It was a pretty big company. Hello, Etra Delivery. Hello. Hello. Their reception was up front. There were four seats there. Oh, it's her. She's here again. I always noticed her. It wasn't like I had a crush on her or anything. She was just always sitting in the same place all the time, not doing anything. I'd never seen anyone talk to her. It was like she didn't even exist. I'd actually never seen her move either. Ah, thank you. Thanks. I wanted to ask about her, but couldn't. Then one day... Hello? Etra delivery? Um, 300 pens, huh? That's a lot of pens. Huh? <laughs> oh no! They must have made a mistake! Oh, Akane. This is our second time this week. Gotta be more careful. <laughs> um... Yeah? I've always wanted to ask. That lady over there, she's always so quiet. Huh? Oh. That lady in the back with the blue hair. What are you talking about? There's nobody there. Huh? But she's right there. Oh, stop it. Yeah, stop messing around. <sighs> I better go. What? They can't see her? Does that mean she's a ghost? I was terrified. I stormed out of there. Huh? The girl with the long hair at the OX building? Yeah, I've seen her before. Oh, phew. I was scared for a second. What's this all about? Well... What? A ghost? Really? I noticed her too. What am I gonna do? I can't go back there! What was that, Kuroki? I need you to go there next week too. What? Oh, come on! It's not like she hurts you, right? Just deliver the goods and leave. Yeah. And so, I had to go back there the next week. <sighs> This sucks. Please don't be there. Hello? Ah, hello. Oh, Mr. Kuroki. Thanks. Ah, she's re- Thanks. I gotta go. Thank you. Bye. Oh, hold on. Yeah? Can you see her? That girl in the back. Yes. Yes, I can. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I didn't think you'd be so scared. Um, uh... It's okay, she's not a ghost. Yeah, everyone just ignores her. Yeah, but for some reason, she still won't quit. <laughs> um, huh? Yeah? What's so funny about that? What's wrong with you? You guys creep me out. Whatever. I went back to the office. Kuroki, I got a call from the OX building. About what? They said they want a new driver. What did you do? Oh, um, well... I told my boss everything that happened. Damn. What should I do? Should I call them anonymously and tell them what's going on? Nah, stay out of it. They probably won't do anything anyways. Yeah. And if she's staying there, she must have her reasons. Just let it go. Don't worry about it. Later. Some new guy filled my spot. They told me that the lady was still there. Then a year later, their office closed shop. I had no idea what happened to them after. Phew. I hope she's doing okay. Ugh, oh, this sucks. Our office closed because our numbers were low. And the new office is so far away. It's all her fault. You guys are mean. What happened to that girl? Who knows? She stopped coming. And I'm not the bad guy here. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this month's budget is pretty tight. I should have taken more money from that girl before she quit. Oh, right! My family sent me some vegetables. Coming! Hey! What the? It's you! ご視聴いただき
存在しているのにいないものとして扱われるのは本当に傷つきますよね配達員さんの目線だったのであの営業所内で何が起きてハブられるようなことになったのか甚だ疑問ではありますがハブられるのは相当なストレスだったんでしょうね追い詰められた人間は何をするのか予想もつかないので幽霊さんよりずっと恐ろしいです皆さんはどう感じましたかコメント欄に書いていただけると嬉しいですまた少しでも怖いなと思った方チャンネル登録と高評価をお願いいたします